All right, what's up, y'all? It's 202 Inc. And yeah, the tweet of the day or <laughs> of the hour is fake is the new real and I don't fit in. Swear to God, I can't do fake stuff. I do not, I can't do it and I don't do it. And once someone does something fake to me, it's a wrap between a relationship. Swear to God, like, you're not about to play in my face, play with me, uh, disrespect me, act funny in front of certain people, and do all this other fake stuff. You're not about to do that and then think I'm going to be cool with it. See, the same people that do all this fake stuff, they get mad when you do the same thing back to them. Get out of here. You know what I'm saying? Uh, let's read one of the responses and see if we can, like, uh, agree on that or, you know, talk off that. Somebody said, fake is the new trend and many, uh, and many are in style. Being fake is so common that being real is seen as offensive. I swear to God, I try to keep it real with everybody. And some people get mad. Why are you mad that I'm keeping it real with you? I'm not about to blow smoke up your butt. You know what I'm saying? I'm not about to suck it. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm not about to do that. I'm about to keep it all the way real. So, that's why I say, cut off the fake people. The iffy people. Wishwashy. Sometimey. You know what I'm saying? All of that is no good. You ain't about to uh, F with me one day and then the next day you don't. Or you're not about to fuck with me when you feel like it. It don't work like that. Like I said before, I'm not a high-maintenance friend or none of that. You don't got to talk to me every day. But what you're not about to do is hit me up only when you need me or need something from me. And then you get mad when somebody can't do nothing for you. I don't do all that. Like, what else is that? People see it as a defensive cut off fake people for real uh, for real reasons, not real people for fake reasons. Like, I'm a, people want you to be fake for real. They want you to be a yes man. They want you to kiss butt. No, it don't work like that. I'm going to keep it all the way real. Shout out to my sister. Me and my brother had got into it on Christmas morning. And then uh, he called my sister to, I guess, tell her about it or whatever. And he got mad because in her response to him telling her what happened, besides him forgetting, deep, not forgetting, but leaving out details of him provoking me, she basically was like, okay, and she's not wrong. You know what I'm saying? You're being petty, so she's going to be petty back, whatever, whatever, whatever. But that's the point. Not playing both sides, just keeping it real. Shout out to Pook. Uh, fake people have an image to maintain, but real people just don't care. Real people are not meant to fit in. I swear to God. Like like I say, fake people, like I said too, fake people have an image to maintain, which means they're going to do anything to maintain that image. You cannot trust a person like that. They will sit up there and flip flop on you, say one thing, then turn around, get around certain people, and say another thing. Some people even change their voice. That's weird. But um, yeah. What else? Yeah, like for real though. Oh lie. That's why I that's why I don't fit in. That's why I'm a chosen one for real, for real. But nah, for real though, like people be people rather you be fake and phony and just do whatever and you know what I'm saying? Nah, no good. That's why I told y'all real people don't have a lot of friends, you know what I'm saying? Or they might know a lot of people or whatever, but the fake people, those are the ones that you see that's always hanging around different people. You'll see them hanging around somebody that they was just talking about. What is this? Yeah, you'll see them hanging around somebody that they was just talking about or something like that. Or you know they don't like a person, but you're trying to hang out with this person so you can benefit off them. No good. Like, comment, subscribe, share.